everyone welcome to my youtube channel this is me Aini and our today's focus is still about speaking because we are in academic speaking class and I am going to explain about speaking skills as the next part of our previous uh, theory so we focus on a learning speaking skill in which learning any language takes practice a lot so you need to practice a lot lots of practice often it's difficult to know what you should practice sometimes and then the students start questioning to me like should i watch a video and i think that's perhaps because it will be a good idea to do a few quizzes from the video uh, to take a lesson from the video so you can learn from any sources actually but of course you should try to speak English with your friends as well even if still in an academic setting so uh, listening or copying the strategy from any video is very recommended but you please don't forget to uh, try to practice in a real life speaking less you need to speak up so all of these are great ideas from the students i mean but it's also important to put it like a routine so make it as a habit make it as regular as possible and that routine will help you to uh to study english as a habit that's what i said and that's the best way to improve your english is that's it so I think just the way to encourage you is that you should make it deeper and are you it's it's the so the way on how to distinguish between the two are about want to and will do you should make it different between what you want to do and what you will do so speaking English fluently isn't a very easy task actually even only if you put your mind to it I mean even only if you put your set your mindset to it so uh, you will do practice I mean you will speak English it's starting from you want to you want to do that you want to you have the willingness to do practicing actually it has a lot to do with a psychological effect as well I mean if you keep the notion in your mind that you will not be able to know how to learn to speak English fluently so you might face problems and that's a quite normal uh, because English is not our first language not even our second language so sometimes you will trembling and you are just nervous on how to speak on or how to practice uh, you are afraid when the people will laugh at you uh, you are afraid that will people know your mistake or something what else and so on that's a psychological effect that will interfere you and influence your product of speaking in the end so uh there's also the thing that you need to consider but by the time you will learn and get used to it so what to worry i think i need to go back to the kinds of speaking so you have english for conversation you have english for public speaking professional speaking and the last is academic speaking and when we start from the kinds of speaking that the students should do there are actually four things that you need to do with speaking practice the first is you need to expose to it means make it out in a real practice and the second is you need to understand its meaning so you don't only need to speak but also you need to understand the meaning you need to understand on the things that you are going to speak and then you need to make sure that you use the language skill uh correct so that the listener also understand what you are going to say that's in the part of the content and the third is you need to understand its form its form related to the structure how it is constructed related to the grammar as well because you know grammar and the meaning cannot be apart and it, they are always related each other and even if uh, you can speak English fluently but if the grammar is incorrect uh, the meaning of your speaking will be not correct or I can say it will be meaningful it will not be meaningful or i can say it will be unmeaningful that's it so between the meaning and the grammar it should be correlate it should correlate each other 
related to each other and those two go beyond together so you cannot you cannot make it fall apart you cannot leave one of them because all of those things are in the same way